Hello again and welcome back to another one. And today we have a couple of topics to cover as Eminem Stan single just turned 21 that sparked reactions online, including one from the OG Stan from the video. And we'll be exploring more on this in a bit. We also have a report that revealed music to be murdered by just hit a new sales milestone globally and producer Frederick reacted to this new milestone. And before we dive into the details, if you enjoy content like this, don't forget to hit the like button, subscribe to the channel if you're new and find me on social media at ET Lifestyle underscore web. So the HBO Rock and Roll Hall of Fame 2021 special is out now and it looks like they listened to what fans pointed out in the promo video where Eminem's LL t-shirt was altered but that decision was reverted for the final show. And moving on to the main topics today, we'll start with Stan and it was officially released as a single on the 20th of November 2000. And based on the impact of the song, many on Twitter have been reacting accordingly. For instance, here's one that goes. 21 years ago, Eminem released Stan, greatest storytelling song of all time, unmatchable legacy, ranked in several lists of greatest songs of all time. Later, the word Stan included in Oxford and Miriam's dictionary, cultural milestone. If you were with us a couple of days ago, Ghostface Killer was ranking the greatest storytelling songs of all time in hip hop and Stan made top 4 and it was this report that got the OG Stan's attention. 20 years ago, Eminem released Stan featuring Dido, the track was met with critical acclaim and hit number one across the globe. It is widely credited for coining the term Stan, which at the time referred to a stalker fan and later made its way into the Oxford English Dictionary. And he reacted to this, the video was released in 2000, the song was released before that, math here is suspect. And here's a hilarious reaction to his post. Stan was released with the MMLP, but it was only released as a single months later, November 20, 2000. They forgot to mention the single part, and when a song becomes a single, that becomes its release date. Well, apart from the fact that the user missed that this was the OG Stan, his response also applies here, math here is suspect, hence this reaction under. Yeah, so that means it was released 21 years ago. By the way, that is the man who acted as Stanley in the music video. There were more jokes that followed. Mariah Carey ended Eminem. They got us all laughing for real. Mariah Carey laughing emojis. They really get brave when Christmas is around the corner. And last year she set a new record in reverse as the Christmas song became the first song ever to drop off the Hot 100 from number one. And coincidentally, this was around the time Eminem broke a 50-year-old record for climbing up the charts when Music To Be Murdered by Deluxe was released. But moving on, some believe Stan's performance in the United States was a bad look for the country. Stan only charted at number 51 in the United States but went number one in the United Kingdom, their taste. It hit number one in 13 countries around the world and I believe the subject matter of the song was deemed too dark for US radio, hence its performance. They gave it the darkness treatment, if you know what I mean. Now back to the OG Stan, he's dropped some gold on Twitter. For instance, when Nick Cannon opened a vegan soul food restaurant in LA, he reacted, when Eminem destroys you and you want no more beef. And he's one of those who also believe Eminem is the GOAT. And for those who hate to see this, before you fly off the handle, remember that your favorite rappers also rated Eminem the GOAT based on an objective study with actual data collection, so rest easy. And the OG gave us this classic 2020 greatest exchanges when he tweeted, there's dudes using Stan in a sentence that weren't even born when the song came out that got this reaction. LOL, another white guy thinks something that the black community made up is about him. Want to add to the collection of greatest fails on social media? Check this out. That dude blacked me after I replied that Eminem ain't black and it had to be said, the kids try so hard to be the wokest of the woke. And moving on, a recent report revealed Eminem's music to be murdered by sold 4 million units worldwide and I believe this includes figures from China where back in December 2020, this popped up. Music to be murdered by by Eminem has now sold over 400,000 digital copies in China. It's the fourth best-selling Western album this year in the country. And the latest report sparked reactions like, that's impressive for someone who people say no one listens to. And this is not even one of his older projects. This is his project from last year, King of Longevity. And on this feat, another added, let's give credit where credit is due. This guy is a legend and always will be. Remember when people thought he wasn't gonna last? You know what time it is? 
What time is it? It's time for you to take this one hit one, the white trash. Uh, one oh, yeah? Oh. Talk Talk to me, guy. Come, Come down here and say that. Talk to me, guy. Hmm. And here's a nice change from Frederick. He's not angry at the, in quotes, stands this time. Shady aftermath. Thank you, stands. Starstruck emoji. Save your thoughts for the comment section. Thanks for watching. And see you on the next one.